Well, for 2018, I'm very happy. Ang positive side nito ng Vaxa scandal is that the Filipino people have become more health literate. Diba? Naintindihan nyo na yung mga programa ng bakuna, magkano ginagasta na yung pamahalaan para sa preventive health, ano yung health system, sino nag approve ng mga bagong gamot, paano nangyayari yan. I'm very happy that this scandal has brought that positive side. Uh, ano yung epektibong gamot, ano yung experimental. Uh, I'm very happy this debate occurred. So, continue as media people to educate uh, the Filipinos and the citizenry on health literacy. Alam nyo, ang trabaho ko abroad eh. Yung front page at saka inside front page, every day in Malaysia where I work, was about health. So, the more we write about health, the more you, that the media discusses the health issues, the more politicians cannot double on the money that we have delegated for the protection of the health of our children. The million children natin, yan ang ating human capital development that will create that will be working and creating economic wealth for the country. So yun ang potential natin is in our children. Pag yan, in-injection na natin ang bakong ng hindi tama, pinatay mo na rin ang Pilipinas. So it's very important that the health sector becomes a very important part with economic development because the best part of any economic development is human capital development and you need a healthy population to actually do that. special year end edition I'd like to thank our colleagues of the media and our guests who took time out to be with us. But please, before you go to bed tonight, please remember our guests and friends who have gone before us. Uh, si Gloria Fernando, yung ating PA, uh, died January 8th this year. So if 